Hey guys, it's Steve on the Guru Brew. Today we're going to talk about shortcuts and how you can access programs that uh, you use all the time. We're going to put them in something called a start menu. And let me show you what the start menu is. If you click on the start key, which is right here, there's a little line that's right above this program that says Eagle. Let me move my mouse out of the way. You can probably see it. It's quite faint. But anything above that line is for a start menu. And these are considered my most useful programs that I use all the time. And you can take programs in and out of that area. So if I use a program all the time, I can access it right from here. Now, last time I did a video on the magnifier, so let me demonstrate by adding the magnifier to the start menu, and you can see how easy it is to do. As you can see right now, above that line, there are no programs that say magnifier, and let's say I use it all the time. So let me come down here and type in magnifier, and you can see it's right here. Now, if I use my right hand mouse button, the right hand one, I get on top of this magnifier and I click on that right hand mouse button, I get this little menu that pops up. And you can see right here, it says pin to start menu. And if I click on that with my left button here, now the magnifier should be added to my start menu. Let's click on the start and look it's right there so every time i want to access my magnifier it is now in my start menu and if i want to take it back out of the start menu i can get right on top of it and again use my right hand mouse button click and i can remove it from the list or i can unpin it from the start menu which i'll do with my left hand button unpin from the start menu and it's gone Let's add another one in there. Let's, uh, let's say I have a program. Um, let's just go on down through here. I tell you what, let's find a game. Let's open a game. Let's say I play hearts all the time and I would like that on top of the start menu. Okay, so again, I get on top of what I want to add to my start menu. I use that right hand mouse button and I select pin to start menu and click it with my left button. Now it should be done. Let's go back to the start menu and you can see now that hearts is added. And again, I can take it away, right hand click, unpin from the start menu and now it's gone again. Now, if you've probably been watching, there's something else in here. Let me go to my calculator and right click on that. And you can also pin it to the taskbar. Let's try that and I'll show you what it does. Instead of the start menu, let's pin it to the taskbar. Click. And now, as you can see, my calculator is down in the taskbar, which is this bar down here. If I come up here and type in magnifier, let's also add that. Right click and pin it to the taskbar. Look, I've just added my magnifier and my calculator. And it works just like the start uh, menu. You can right click again and you can unpin it from the taskbar. Boom. Boom. So as you can see, I can add quick shortcuts to my most used functions of my computer. And that's it. It's a great tip that you'll use all the time now, now that you know how to do it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please leave us a thumbs up and a comment if you wish. If you have your own question that you would like answered, please head over to the gurubrewshow.com website, click on the Ask a Tech link and leave a question and maybe we'll answer it in an upcoming show. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.